another behind the scenes question about your experiences. I mean, it's clear that it's a labor of love and, and, and I, I know we all really appreciate all the work that you put into it. And I want to get a sense of, of how much it is. Uh, and I know you also have big staff and so on, but um, as professional musicians, right? You, you have an hour or two on stage and there's a ton that goes into that, of course. Um, I, I wonder if you might uh, say a bit about how uh, the preparation that goes into being a musician is different from the preparation that goes into this. Like, is it a similar, you know, no. million no. to one ratio, or like, what's the... Uh... This, this involves a hell of a lot more lists. <laughs> ask, yeah. ask Drew about lists sometimes. A lot of lists. The sheer, the sheer number of details that need to be organized and kept track of and assigned to people and followed up on, it's crazy making. The document... Uh, there's a document that I always delight in showing to my to my friends as I'm looking at it as I'm leaving for the cruise and they're like, why are you so stressed out about this cruise? I'm like, dude, take a look at this document. The, and the document is what happens on the first day. It is a moment by moment description of what happens on the first day and who is doing what and at what time. And it is 25 pages long. It's It's crazy. <laughs> You look at it. You look at it, and you're like, a crazy person made this because they don't know what they're doing, and this is just random writings and scrawls about details that don't matter. But they all matter. It's crazy. So the the amount of work that goes into this is not just sitting around and thinking of stuff, but but really just pushing these details from one place to another and keeping them organized. Because you know, if we if we do if we do almost everything right, but we forget something something that is really important, <laughs> it's a terrible experience for everybody. So we have to get it all right, uh, or as close to that as we can. And that's the thing that is so time consuming. And to tie it with, with sort of the musician brain, I would say it's oppositional, but it is a completely different skill set. And all four of us have had a professional experience, so we have that. Um, and it's taken us time, it's, it, it's a year-round thing, and especially the last three months, it's really, a super duper full time job and just a regular full time job the rest of the year. But indeed, it's because we love it so much and it's fun and it's always evolving. We do it for you, all for you. I also, I also made the mistake of launching my album pre order store in the week before I, <laughs> I don't know how it's that happened. It's a happened. weird date, yeah. <laughs> but a weird date to choose, yeah. But every year that we do it, like we learn how to, how to sort of partition your brain and switch between I'm doing spreadsheets, I'm doing music. It, it's manageable. Yeah, and during the year, um, Anna and me are full-time um, working on the booking website, uh, our inventory, the list that we send to the cruise line, and then we have um, a part-time uh, contractor, Danielle, from a company called Lady Killer, who does our VIP and hospitality booking accountants. Um, and uh, this year was a big, we grew 50% uh, guest-wise, um, and so that strains the, the organization significantly, and that I think everybody, I know Anna and I both like literally <laughs> cried about the list a few times. You're getting a month off after this. <laughs> we, can't but, afford, uh, we can't afford to take a month off, true. What's, uh, what's crazy is that we have 300 plus pages of procedure manual written already for the staff that comes on board because we're really small throughout the year with our regular operation like planning for it and there are about 50 people working for us now in some capacity on board plus the internship so it's a lot of it is actually just preparing for this I mean thinking about every minute of seven days during the other um, 358 is, is very it's a trip <laughs> I would like to, uh, not to single one person out at the expense of others, uh, but I would like to give a personal shout out to uh, Shadowmaster Bob Rage, who, yes, sorry, I, no, 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 it, but I, um, I'm in charge of programming, and he's generally been handling, handling more and more of, of Shadow Cruise stuff over the years, such that I haven't had to worry about it too much, and this year, I just sort of had to turn off that part of my brain as I saw all that stuff coming in. And I said, okay, Bob, have fun. Try not to interfere with any of the main stuff. And good luck with that. And he did an incredible job. Thank you so much, Bob. Please.